There you go. With this haircut. You should fit in more with the locals. The super salon can give you the hairstyle of your dreams. All right. He said that Valentine should be able to help me. The hub of trade for all diamond city. I should start looking for Valentine's office. game changer. Detective that way. Okay. Sometimes you That's useful. Does anyone fight back? Institute has to have enemies, right? What? You mean the railroad? Well, that's a fairy tale, man. They don't exist. Nah, I heard from my cousin. He hmm. knows a guy that works for him. Did he I hear a cat? And everything. Follow the Freedom Trail. The hell is that supposed to mean? You're freedom Trail. It, and that kind of talk is going to get you snatched up by the sense. There's Valentine's that Detective no Agency. Hopefully he can help. Told you your luck wouldn't last forever. Um. His ties. Excuse me. Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just the detective. He's gone missing. Don't worry, I can help. Tell me what happened. Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use mm -hmm. as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please, hurry. Well, it looks like I'm about ready to go find a detective so he can find my son. Very ironic. Well, before I head out... I'm gonna go see Piper. Give her her interview she wanted. If you're heading outside the wall, I can't believe you eat that food. Only one thing worth buying in the dugout in, and that's the booze. Man's eat. <sighs> what can I say? Don't move, Sam. What have you done with the real what the heck? Riley? Where's my brother? I swear I'm not a synth. Don't shoot, for God's sakes, we're family. What the heck's going on here? Put the gun down now. He's a Sith. He'll kill us all. Sith. Kyle. What the no! heck? Okay. Show's over. There are no Sins in Diamond City. Hear me? Just you folks and your damn paranoia. He pulled the gun on me. My own brother. What happened? I'm. I'm not a Sith. I. I told him. I. I kept telling him. Why didn't he listen to me? I. Uh, I need a minute. I need you to step away, Scabber. I understand, officer. I just wanted to know what happened. What, you didn't hear the shouting? Guy pulls a gun on his own brother, thinking he's a synth. It's that newspaper's fault. Got people all riled up, thinking their own family might be replaced by machines. Look, I'm sorry you got caught up in all this, but it's over, okay? Just go about your business like nothing happened. Better that way. What's everyone still standing around for? Go back to your own damn business. Dang. I know it's rude, but Mr. you don't mind if I take some stuff off of it, right? Everything to even you yeah, I don't guess nobody cares. Not in work, but wouldn't want to leave the good stuff. That's true. Alright. Glad you dropped by. Whoa. Yep, yeah, Piper, I'm ready for that interview. Holding up, Blue? Why are you calling me that? Cause you're a vault dweller? 
I know you're not wearing the blue jumpsuit right now, but the pit boy and the fish out of water look, dead giveaways. So here's the deal. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what, I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. All right, Piper, I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. So, I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? My family and I are frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. W wait, <laughs> they boxed you up in a fridge? The whole time? Are you saying you were alive before the war? Yes, I'm over 200 years old. Oh my god. The man out of time. So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? Honestly, seeing everyone surviving out here, rebuilding the world, it gives me hope. That's surprisingly inspired, Blue. We're definitely quoting that. Now, I already know you're looking for your son, Sean. Do you suspect the Institute was involved in his kidnapping? I don't know. No one ever does. That's what makes them so scary. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? You can only take it one day at a time. Just keep going. That's all anyone can do. We're all just doing what we have to, huh? I think my readers can relate to that. That's everything. It's gonna take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is gonna give Diamond City plenty to talk about. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. Head my way? Sure, let's go. Will do. Miss Wright, I trust you'll do your best to put the safety of my master before your own personal gain. Of course, Codsworth. <laughs> Jesus. Lucky for me, those two things go hand in hand. Codsworth, you just go away to Sanctuary Hills, okay? What were you hiding? All right, Piper, let's head on out. Oh, foggy. It's big, loud, full of corrupt officials and brown nosing citizens, but it's home. A very foggy one. I ain't telling you how to pick your friends. But Pipe is kind of a troublemaker. That may be true. Need to find Valentine. Really foggy out here. Make sure I keep reloaded. Looks like it's this way. Over here, Piper. I bought. 
Weird to see those things still here. Alright. Need to be very careful. One thing I've learned about this world. It's dangerous. Best to avoid conflict when it arises. So you never know what's gonna happen. Sorry, Piper. Let's take him out. You picked up the wrong people today. Hey, something's out there. <clears throat> there you are. Crap. Another raider. Ow. That takes care of them. Not really much good on it. No good gear on him. You're not replacing me. What the heck? Someone, please help! This thing is gonna kill me. I said, keep your mouth shut. Someone, please help! This thing is gonna kill me. I said, keep your mouth shut. Please, please help! I don't want to die. Shut your mouth, or I swear I'll shut it for you. Someone, please! Help! This thing is gonna kill me! Please! What? You gotta help me! Why can't I feel this my guy's head? a synth, and he, he's gonna kill me and replace me and my family! Oh, God. My kids. Don't you dare bring them up. He's the synth, <clears throat> and he wants to replace me! Please! Please, you gotta believe me! You can't let that thing do this! Uh, let's all just calm down. No one has to die. No, he wants me dead. He's never gonna stop. I have to kill him. Don't listen to it. It'll say anything to convince you. Look, all I need is for you to put down the gun. Then we can talk this through. No, no. Why don't you just tell me? How this happened? How this, uh, fine. I, I was on my way to Bunker Hill. I round a bend, and I see this guy, me, gun drawn, ready to fire. After that, it's a, it's a blur. We scuffle for a while, but I won. Now, I don't know what else I can say to convince you he's the synth. Now, are you gonna get out of my way? Synths are robots, so you're telling me that you took down a robot and disarmed him. You won't be doing anything if I take you down first. Oh, thank God. Damn it, I'll kill you! Oh, no. Oh! I have a really bad feeling I did something stupid. Make sure my guns are loaded. I 
think I should try to avoid the danger. Maybe go around. Oh, I almost shot you. I have another feeling I just Head did something. Inside. Whoa, scared me. I have another feeling I just did something stupid again. Gotta make sure my gun's reloaded. Gonna have to be careful. Never know what might happen. What was that? Dang raiders. here. Come on, Piper. They're not worth it. Come on. God, getting this many bad feelings. This is getting old. But they've never led me astray before. Guess I need to stop being stupid. Maybe their stuff. Shouldn't loot it. I almost shot you. You should be careful. Takes care of you. Okay. Oh. Better that thing to hurry up and explode. And flying body. Yeah. Yeah, let's move out. I 
I have a feeling we're getting close. Hey, something's out there. And now it's dead. Not enough. <laughs> That looks tough. Should probably head out before they see us. Whoa, crap. I accidentally lit, lit that thing. Reload. Oh that? crap. I'll find Duck you. behind something, idiot. Think you can hide? Actually, yes, I can. In this situation, it's best to rush the enemy. They're everywhere. Still here? But we could take care of them. Gonna head this way. Bag of cement. That might be useful. That's creepy. Let's ignore them. They're not worth it. Our mission is Valentine. We need to save everything, all of our resources for him. Torn letter. Bottle caps. Squirrel bits. This is the start of the Freedom Trail. Should remember that if I ever need to find the railroad one day. If they even exist. Alright, let's head in. Sure, everything's all good. I'm 
telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this place. I still say Malone's weak. We caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Well, don't let his new girl hear that. She'll start swinging that bat of hers at your face until there ain't no face left. Let's try to do this stealthily. Oh, I'll find you. Get rid of him. I'm telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Shh. Look at this place. I still say Malone's weak. Let's see what I got. Caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Well, don't let his new girl hear that. She'll start swinging that bat of hers at your face until there ain't no face left. Bad idea. Getting rained on over here. They got the drop on him. It's gonna blow you up. Oh, you had caught him. Lost him. Yeah. He's here for the detective. I him. Jesus! Let's take care of this. Stealthily and simple. Close those gaps. Come on. I still say Malone's weak. We caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Well, don't let his new girl hear that. She'll start swinging that bat of hers. Let's see what I can use to take care of them. your face until there ain't no face left. This is not a ranged weapon. Get off them. Just going to waste otherwise. I can get the mod off that. Could take some of the stem packs to take care of the pain. Help myself heal up. More bullets. Submachine gun that ought to be useful. Take the gold watch and sell it. All right. 
let's take that and put that there. This gun's good. Okay, that didn't hurt too much. Good for long range combat. Gun's nice and comfortable. But I think this gun will be better for long range. Ooh, that could have been bad. Doubt that. Oh, sorry, Piper. Hope that didn't hurt too much. What was that? Good riddance. I could definitely turn this into one good sniper. Blue, we're not alone. Feels better. Guess we showed them. Now time to loot. I think I'm getting the hang of this. Gun drops. Let's roll on a stick. Always good to have some food. Pork and beans, mute fruit. Uh we're to have just toothpaste on you. Wait, rapid submachine gun. Ooh, that thing's better than the one I currently have. You can definitely tell it's modified. Let's see. It's not much better, but it looks like it shoots faster.
<sighs> All right, dandy apples, dirty water, some beer bottles. I can sell that stuff. I always use that for my modifications. Should be getting back into enemy territory here. Who's there? Me. I know, I'm on it. Gotcha. You too. Just going to waste otherwise. Exactly. For a porter, you have pretty good. Aim with that gun. A vault. Figures. Open this thing up. Thank god I have this pit boy. Escape from a vault. Going back into one. To save the detective that will help me get my son back. Very ironic. Very. Very ironic. Like a hell cut.